that wild shootout in downtown Atlanta overnight. Violence erupted after police tried to pull over a vehicle and officers opened fire when the armed passenger tries to get away. ABC's Lindsay Davis here with the story. Good morning, Lindsay. Good morning, George. Police say an officer noticed a red Jeep going the wrong way down the road. They say they attempted a routine traffic stop, but the car sped up, crashing into a shuttle bus. They say the passenger ran and that decision proved fatal. Typically tranquil downtown Atlanta, sounding like a war zone. <laughs> Sending bystanders fleeing for cover. Yo, go inside, Rick. Oh my God. The cops actually only just maybe 100 yards in front of us were hiding behind their cars with their guns, so we didn't even have as much cover as them. It all began when officers attempted to pull a car over in a routine traffic stop, but the driver didn't stop, striking a pole and a hotel shuttle. The driver turned himself in, but his passenger fled behind this hotel. We have a male shot. Male is still moving. He is injured. Officers shoot the passenger dead. His body discovered near a dumpster, allegedly with a gun and shell casings nearby. Police squads barricade the scene, seizing at least three weapons, along with cash and a duffel bag filled with a large quantity of marijuana found inside the Jeep. Police say three officers were involved in the shooting. None of them were injured. They are all now on administrative leave pending the outcome of this investigation. And can you imagine being inside that hotel where you just heard the gunfire just so rapidly? It all happened so yes, fast. Gary. Okay, Lindsay, thanks very much.